there were a lot of those years recently when I thought, this is it, this is gonna be the one. This is gonna be the year where I finally have that heart attack and we're done. And then I won't have to worry about it anymore. You get looked at, you get pointed at, you know, it, it hurts to have that, uh, that called out. I've had days where I, I get a glass from the kitchen and a bottle of maple syrup and I pour myself a glass. And then I, I dash into my, my room, climb under the bed to hide and drink that glass of maple syrup. <laughs> there were donuts for breakfast, cookies for lunch and brownies for dinner. You know, I, I just wanted sugar. And then I get to this point where I'm, I'm, I'm gonna stop. It's a common story, many of us know, even if we haven't lived it for ourselves, we know about the prejudice and discrimination that results in teasing and bullying as a, as a child, and uh, lost job opportunities and promotions as an adult. But there's more than that. There's uh, depression, of course, and, and uh, a challenging of your own self-worth and, and value. I made goals for myself. And I chased after them with complete dedication, and it worked. I was losing weight, I was moving better, and that encouraged me to keep trying. 